Today we have a fun project for you. It's how to build a cedar planter box. All you need are two pieces of wood. This is a six foot cedar fence board. This is one by six. And then you need an eight foot one by two clear cedar board. And there's just a few other tools and supplies that you need. You need a tape measure. You need something for a straight edge, a pencil hammer and nails, and we're using roofing nails that have a blunt edge so that you don't split the wood in the planter box, plus they're galvanized so they don't rust. And you also need some kind of a saw, either a hand saw or an electric saw. So we're gonna take our boards now, we're gonna measure them out and start cutting, and we'll show you how that comes together. So now we're gonna cut our sides and our bottom out of our seat and fence board, and those are all gonna be 19 and 3 quarter inches long. So now with the remaining section of our cedar fence board, we're going to cut our ends. And both of those are 4 and 13 sixteenths. From the 1 by 2 cedar board, we're going to cut the decorative frame for the top of the planter box, which looks like a picture frame. We're going to cut two pieces of 20 and 5 eighths inches, and each side is going to have a 45 degree angle. From that same 1 by 2, we're going to cut the smaller edges of the frame, and that measurement is 8 and 7 16 inches. From the remaining part of that board, we're going to cut two pieces, 8 and 1 half inches, and those will be the feet of the planter box. Now that all the boards are cut, we're going to start nailing it all together. Ryan, are you ready? Now that we have our planters completed, we can go through and drill some drain holes in the bottom. And if you would like to tackle this really easy project, you can go to the Garden Time website and we'll have the instructions there and you can download them.